what are you, so you're thinking, what should you start with? What is gonna make sense as a first thing? How about we take a look at a couple of products? Sure. Yeah? Yeah. While well, everybody's watching. Yeah. Oh. Before we blow the doors off this barn, with the big news that we've got, it's cool. I can put that here. It looks like it's blocked, but it's clearly not blocked. Oh, yeah, they're pretty clever, isn't it? It is very clever. I like <laughs> how you've done that. It upsets me. Look, there it's blocked. Yes, here, and there it isn't. Not blocked so much. Phantom, classic re-release. Mm. And this is the second shipment and probably yes. the final shipment, I dare say, of this classic re-re. The Phantom, four-wheel drive, one-twelfth chain drive pan car. That's right. The CRC2, meaning it does have suspension. So I'm going to go to the overhead town and have a little bit of a look in the box. Look at this. It's got all cast and machined alloy parts. Mm. Really, really nice. It's got a machined alloy pod. Yes. Geez, they made them heavy duty back in the day, didn't they? And if you have a look over here, let's go to zoom zoom in a bit. How's the rear suspension work? Is it like a, um, like a T-bar type of thing? Has it got cutouts? Look well, at that. Look at the chain there. drive. I'm just having a quick look oh, at the spur gear, the diff, and the chain drive. Yep. Really, really cool. So there'll be one ways in there, right? That's a, that be, a standard sort of thing. I reckon there'll be one ways in there. Mm -hmm. Look at that. And it's got a, a monoshock at the back. So that'll, that'll be a flexing rear pod, yeah? Yeah, not a monobrow. Monoshock. Good thing I shaved. Where? Well, I'm just saying it's a good thing I shaved. Good. I'm glad you did. I'm getting them. There it is. Back in stock. CRC2. Don't diddly dally around. It's the only one that we've got. What did you say? Don't dilly dally around. If you're interested, make it so. It's nice. Make it so. Next Very good. Thing I've got. Before we go anywhere, check out this bad boy. This just came in. It just came in a matter of minutes ago. This is the FSR or FS Racing Sniper. And this is closely related to the Victory MT monster truck. It is. And how much do we love that? It's probably been a year since we got Winnie out of his box. It's pretty fantastic. No, we destroyed bloody Federation Square. We flew a kite. We put dust in people's sandwiches. Didn't yeah, we? Yeah, that wasn't intentional, but it was funny. It was funny. Yeah. This is awesome. So this is the latest, what, newest model from FS Racing? Yeah, I say it's an evolution, isn't it? And I've just taken the liberty of reading the side of the box. Oh, it's, it's great. I think I think we're going to have to read it later. Most entertaining. It is. It is very good. It is. I'm going to, some of them should be memes. It should be what? Memes. <laughs> no? You want to go from the top? Is it going to fit? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull it out. That's it. What are we greeted with? A bag of bag decals. Of We've got some decals. We've got some servo horns. Yes, some, some tools. Some Allen keys. So you get a big chunky Allen key for adjusting and the captured balls. The instructions on the radio and indeed the truck itself yes so you want to hang on to these because yes. the service and repairs and the part numbers will also correlate to our website already yeah look at the truck Get this thing out oh so this is the truggy version of, of the victory of the victory mt mt i'm guessing i oh. don't know for a fact stands for monster truck have a look at this. And I don't like talking prices on the show, so I won't. But check it out online. This is amazing value. And this comes ready to run and not ready to run like you need to spend $800 on a battery and charger. No. It it's comes ready to run with 3S battery mm. and charger. Mm. Phenomenal. Let's have a look. Well, once you take the body off, you can see the similarities between this and the Victory. But have a look at the body itself. So the it's body is skid, actually beefy. Skid plate. Skid yeah. plate. LEDs, yes, like lights. the Victory MT, we know how bright they are. Yes, reinforcements around the body posts. I like so how you, it's got attached body body clips. You would have loved these back in the day. Did you have these on your touring car? On a touring car? Yeah, back in the day, you would have had the no, no, the, the cable I, ties and uh, cable ties and fuel tube. Remember I did, that fad? <laughs> I didn't do that, but I had these like which were attached to the body on my early monster truck truggy. I like to put tassels on mine so they flap around in the breeze. Tassels. Have a look at that. Beautiful body. Yeah. Fully reinforced. 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 Yeah. Really know, good we thing. We know how these can end up on their roofs. They will. It's designed to be bashed and bashed hard. So when you have a look at it, you can see Not the... in a domestic violence kind of way, in an RC kind of way. No, no, you can't say that. So as you can see, 
the chassis is the same sort of configuration as Victory, but it's yes. just longer. A bit longer. Yeah. Longer so, wheelbase. So we've got double walled uh, size on the chassis, which is the tub, which adds a lot of rigidity. So it's not monocoque, it's double wall. Double wall monocoque. Double wall monocoque. Yeah, That's yeah. a mouthful. But not, but not just that. It also That's a mouthful. has this supporting beam across the top, almost like a top plate. Yeah, commonly referred to on the side of the box as a lozenge. Is it now? Yep. A lozenge. Well, uh, that'll be hard to put sure. in your mouth. Speak for yourself. All right. <laughs> now, what else is different? Three and a half oh, thousand oxygen. milliamp 3S battery. Yes. That comes with it. And realistically, that's all you'd want in it on 3S. Mm. If you're going to go, I, I prefer, I know the Victory MT also comes with the same battery. Yes. I prefer it to run on 2S, yeah. but put like a 7,500 milliamp battery. Yes. Because the lower voltage will mean that you can run it longer without cooking everything. Three and a half thousand. Well, if you put like a 7,600 3S battery in here and you're just driving it flat out, there's a good chance that you will burn it to the ground. Well, there'll be a bit of heat for sure. A lot of heat because mm. this thing flies. Mm. But that said, they have upgraded the, the heat sink. Yeah, that helps. Because, that helps. I mean, you got, you got a lot more mass with this because everything's bigger. It's got longer yeah. arms. It's longer in length. So it's bigger all over. Isn't it? We've got the same slipper clutch set up. Yeah. Same hobby wing speedy, yeah. Same metal geared servo, yeah. Really, really good, and same radio gear. So you got metal um, shocks, metal, so metal cylinders, and metal caps. Yep. We've got the the super long arms, which are go to Zoom Town. Zoom in. Have a look at that. Go to overhead. Go to Zoom Town. Yeah, yeah. We're not in there. Have a look in there. We've uh, and got. Where, where am I going? Oh, that's exactly right. Look oh, at that inserts. arm design. Look at the arm inserts. Yeah. Just like, look like the screws. And the screws. The hexes. Good quality fasteners. Mm. And we've got arm inserts. And what does that do? Makes it stiff. Makes it stiff, but also gives it some much flexy. Much flexy. Well, it leads it to be like a softer polymers. Yeah, that's that right. It so it's got, it's got a lot of nice. give. Look at that. It's got a lot of give, but it'll hold its shape. That's what you want. A bit like you. Yeah. Underneath, like the Victory MT, skid plate, skid plate. Yeah, metal skid plates. Chassis. Yeah. Good job. Longer arms, longer wheelbase, bigger yep. truck. So front suspension is still the captured ball, and hence why in the toolkit they gave you the um, the really big Allen key, so yep. you can adjust those easily. Yep. I but love it. All over it doesn't, really it doesn't have a wheelie bar, but it does, however, have a whopping big wing that is really, really, really thick. strong. Because that's your wheelie bar there, people. That's it. And we've got a shock tower protector. Yep. For when Front you, and back. When you absolutely stove it. Yep. I love it. I'm excited. Are you excited? I'm excited. The radio is the same as a Victory MT. I think it's pretty good. FSR Racing Australia actually absolutely sent us a sample unit. They did. So keep a look out because we might go over and destroy Federation Square again. I think we'll do a good job of it too. Hey? Yeah. This thing's going to be epic. Yeah. Should what we fly a kite again? Why not? No, I say we dive bomb it with one of the Corsairs. Oh, I we haven't done that yet, have we? I say we put on a show. That's what we were thinking of doing, wasn't it? Hey, go yeah. fly a Corsair down there. Yeah, why not? Try and land it on the roof of this while we're driving along. Yes. What do you reckon? Yes. What could we go can, wrong? We can try. We can only try. That's it. That is the FSR Sniper. I think that's really good.